How you doing out there? You ever seem to have one of those days where it just seems like everybody's getting on your case from your teacher all the way down to your best girlfriend? Okay, welcome to this week's edition of the Barroom Blitz. We're back here at Casey's. Me and Alex, no cheeks, on assignment. He's down in Dallas. You better report Working good. hard. <laughs> working hard. He's hanging out with Michael Irvin, I heard. <laughs> in oh the gosh. motel room. Him, him, Michael Irvin, and Dion. <laughs> that Clock in the hose, he is. Uh. All right, Eagles, first <laughs> preseason game the other night. We right. had some promise, some uh, questions, the same questions we had last year. Offense right. looked decent. Defense looked very Swiss cheeses. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I mean, first I mean, play of the game, right up the middle, down. <laughs> Set 70 yards later. Yeah. But, uh, I don't know, I mean, the offense, did you see any difference from last year? I didn't really. I, no. I, mean, I, would, I didn't see none of it. Like, I was, we were working, and I was, it was Friday night, so it was a tough game for me to watch. Yeah. But I watched some of the replays, but I didn't see any. Like, they said the average play was like 17 seconds. Yeah, there was times when, which, you know, it was upbeat. They were running yeah. no huddle. The only thing I liked, like, uh, uh, when I saw a lot of it, uh, the replay when I watched it was the plays were getting called in. Mm-hmm. You know, there wasn't none of this, like, you know, McNabb used to, like, wait and wait and wait for, the, you know, hands on the thing, see, here to play. Stuff was rolling fast, you right. know, so I thought that was promising. Vic had a nice pass to Deshaun Jackson, yeah. and then Foles had a nice touchdown pass, and then Barkley had a nice pass at the end of the game to get him to the one-yard line and stuff like that. I mean, it wasn't horrible. No, it but wasn't I don't, all that bad. I think people, the problem with the Eagles this year, for some unknown reason, people think they're a playoff team. Right. Or they're they're going, you know. You know I think it's going to be you got a year. I'm or so waiting for. So I, I expect a three and twelve or three and uh, you, you know do? three and thirteen I'm, I'm season. Them six I figured six wins six is fine. Ten. They get to seven or eight, get five hundred. We're fine. But don't I mean these people? I don't know what they expect. I mean, like, you know, it's like you got Kerry Williams comes out and says this team needs to get nasty. It does. The defense, you know, maybe you know, <laughs> it's just the wrong guy saying it. I mean, you know, boy, the Patriots had like a hundred and. 150, 160 yards rushing, I think, right. or something against Yeah, him. but I mean, like, it wasn't like a horrible, horrible game. And Tim, nah, it wasn't. Tim that Tebow, that. please stop. <laughs> he stinks. I like him, but he, he's got heart. Oh, yeah, he's got heart. I got heart. I, you put me on TV, I got heart. I, he stinks. He can't play quarterback. Oh, no, right? it's it. I mean, but. it was all right in Denver because he had a nice little team around him. He got a nice little run and had, you know, had a defense had nice that could defense, win. defense, right. He's but not, you know. He ain't a quarterback. No, it was, kinda, it was ugly. My word here: Brent Selleck ends up on the New England Patriots. Really? Yes. What? So if he has you on your fantasy league, I guarantee he's going there. At the end of the season, we year? have there's no before the season starts. Before it sto- Oh wow! Yeah, because right. Krakowski's hurt, oh, and I don't yeah. care what Jay Keller says. He drafted him in his fantasy league. Other <laughs> he's hurt. He's not going to start the first. No, game. he's not. Yeah, he do. Uh, Gronk's, Gronk's a good re- tight end. Yeah, he's a good tight end. Two years ago, but now he's partying hard and breaking his arms and yeah, stuff. He's, he's living. He's living the college life. Yeah, they really. Um, really but uh, they need a tight end, and Selleck's the odd man out. They got the uh, the guy from uh, Stanford. Oh, Zach Ertz. Zach Ertz. Then they got Clay Harbor, and right. there's uh, Casey. They got, and there's one other guy. Sean they Casey, got, yeah. and they they got like they got five or six tight ends in camp. There's no way they're going to keep all them. They're mm-hmm. going to keep four. Selleck's money pickup. will be I think out. It'd be a good pickup for the Patriots. Like obviously, I think Tom it would Brady be too. And it'd be a good. It'd end. be a great shot for. For uh, him to, for good, him to yeah. get a shot at the title, I mean, Absolutely. you know, good veteran move. Put him on the team. You're not putting him in like Death Valley or whatever. You know, not sending I mean, him to Cleveland good. Browns. I mean, he is kind of. I mean, he's kind of like a Gronk, just not as fast. Or, yeah, I mean, he he's b- down he and big, he can catch the ball. Body. You know, right. I don't know about his blocking because I know that the, mm-hmm. the tight ends in New England like to block a lot. But I, I, th- I just think when we get back to the subject here, is too many Eagles fans. Just I mean, and you know that too. The way your family is, and the way your the fans of your team are, they see like, sh- like right down. Oh, it's you gotta open tunnel. your eyes up. Oh, you exactly. know, if you want to watch the football games, you know, it's like watching baseball. If you want to watch a good team, watch the St. Louis Cardinals. Don't watch mm-hmm. the don't watch the Philadelphia Phillies. Well, you you're know exactly what I mean? Right. You know, there's I mean, good teams out there, and it, it just relax. I think you know. Other other teams. I mean, how did Dallas look? They played the, the oh, it's the it's, Raiders it's the other a, night. It seems like a repeat of last year. Yeah. Um, we started off. Romo gets sacked. He's running around. Just it's he can't, he gets okay. He gets to the red zone and he just can't put a touchdown in. It's just it. And then they is it because they don't have goal. a running back that can get it in oh, there? Oh, Murray, Murray looked pretty decent. Dez was catching some nice passes, but it's just Romo's not a leader. Yeah, at all. At all. Mm. I don't know. I mean, maybe they should. I really wish they would have went after Peyton Manning two years ago, but 
Yeah. I look what he did there, and it's just Romo. And it's going to be another year like that. They're going to finish maybe 9-7 and seven and just sitting outside of the playoffs. Yeah, or squeak in and yeah, lose one. and then lose it, yeah. He's, um, just, he's not the answer. Absolutely. Other teams that you heard about were like uh, the Kansas City Chiefs, and Alex Smith comes out, mm-hmm. seven for eight, right off the bat, little Andy Reid. Yeah, well, <laughs> that's going to be interesting when he comes to Philly in week yeah. two. Week two or three it is. Two, I think. I think. Yeah. No, two, no, three. Because I think they got the Redskins, they got somebody, and then the Thursday night game. Yeah. They play That'll Monday. be fun. Yeah. Uh, any other teams, that anything stand out that you, <sighs> you heard about? I mean, I, I caught um, just glimpses. EJ Manuel. He had a big game, He had right? a big game, yeah. And, and the guy had a big punt return, didn't he? They, they I didn't watch. I was just uh, looking at the I punt just punt saw, right. I remember highlights of the guy running back a punt return for the Bills. Um... Sanchez threw an interception, pick six for his first play. First of all, first if my quarterback <laughs> looks like Sanchez, did you see him? No, I, I watched the highlight. I didn't really watch yeah, the game. You go from a guy like Johnny Unitas. <laughs> all right, that's a quarterback. Joe Namath was a stylish quarterback. Mark Sanchez has long hair and a bandana in his hair. Oh, that's, yeah, that's underneath really dumb. his helmet. I, I mean, <laughs> I didn't even know he did that for his helmet. He did it for the press conference. Co- I saw it at the press conference. Then I saw a highlight of him on the bench. Tell, like, go back to California. Oh, man. my gosh. Get over it. You're, you're another Matt Liner. You suck. Oh, USC yeah. quarterback stink. Absolutely. So, ba- Matt Barkley, you're done. You're not going to have a <laughs> shot. And uh, Geno Smith also. He's got hurt. He got hurt, yeah. Yes. Not too bad, though. They said he was practicing. Nah, yeah, he's feeling Twist his fine. ankle. I think he's going to win. Jamal Charles got hurt, too. Yeah, he had Twist a sp- his ankle, though, sprained, or strained foot. Right foot. X-rays so came it's up not, negative. So yeah, it's fine. not his left. It's his right. Yeah, so, well. Reed said he'll be fine. And, and Chargers, and I, big thing today, Chargers, King Dunlap is the starting left tackle. King Dunlap. <laughs> yeah, my Wasn't boy. He here? Yeah, he's Wasn't right he here. here. Where is he? Big King, where is he at? Right here. There he is. He's starting left tackle. Bye-bye, <laughs> Philip Rivers. <laughs> You're done. Oh, <laughs> All right. Great. Well, you know what time it is now. It's time for us to grab an icy cold Bud Light. Absolutely. We'll be right back with some more Barroom Blitz. Dot com.